How's it going everyone? It's the Jirus here. In this video, I'm going to show you how to make a stash in DayZ and what you need to find in order to do so. If you find this helpful, make sure to leave a like and subscribe. To get started, you will need to find one of these tools displayed here, which includes the shovel, pickaxe, and farming hoe. These items will allow you to dig a stash on a surface area. These items can be found in common sheds that are located in almost every residential and industrial area on the map. There are limited items in the game that can be used as a stash. Some items may be a bit harder to find than others and can carry more loot. The various items include a sea chest, wooden crate, dry bag backpack, protective case, cooking pot, dry sack bag, ammo box, and lastly, a teddy bear. Once you've acquired the necessary items in order to create a stash, you will want to head out into a discreet location such as the woods to hide and make your stash. When you have found a notable spot, you will lay the item on the ground that you wish to use as a stash and put one of the three tools in your hands. You will be prompted with the berry icon when looking directly at the item. An animation will play out and once it has completed, there will be remnants of dirt identifying that a stash has been made. Make sure that you always make your stashes in unusual places and where there is less foot traffic. I would highly suggest not putting a stash in a city, but rather in a rural area. One of the best places to put a stash is inside a grave. It is the same concept when making one, except this time there are no dirt remnants that will identify to a player that a stash has been made, unless they are actively looking with one of the tools in their hands. Another very simple way to make a stash is to find a barrel like this in any industrial area. These barrels have significant storage, but may take a moment to haul around. They can be just as effective to store items as you do not need to bury them, but rather hide them in distinct locations such as groups of trees. I hope you all found this video helpful. If you did, make sure to leave a like and subscribe. If you have questions, make sure to also comment below. I'll catch you all in the next video. Peace!